So in this video, we're gonna talk about how to grow your email list here on YouTube. I have five tips tricks, things that you should be doing, need to be doing. If you aren't doing, then you're not you're not doing everything you could be doing to grow your email list here on YouTube. Hey guys, it's Meredith from vidpromom.com and the Video Pursuit Podcast. And this is my last video here, uh, <laughs> not forever, but just in my YouTube Playbook for Bloggers series. Uh, since I kicked off the Video Pursuit podcast, I wanted to do something a little different here on my YouTube channel for all my blogger friends out there who are curious about creating videos and getting serious about YouTube. So this is the last one. I actually have a way that we're going to continue the YouTube playbook for blogger series off of this YouTube channel. So stay tuned for all of the details about that. And hot off the presses, I just created this YouTube for bloggers cheat sheet and checklist. So if you wanna make the most out of every upload that you publish on YouTube, you can head over to youtubeforbloggers.com that will redirect you to the option page to grab that freebie. And I'll put a link down in the description below, but I'll remind you at the end, so just keep watching. Now I'm assuming if you're a blogger, you already understand the importance and the necessity of an email list. So I'm not going to get into that, but in video and on YouTube, it's so much easier to get people to hop onto your email list when you have something to give them. You have something to give them in return. So a free cheat sheet or checklist, kind of like the one I have. You can download that. You have to give me your email address first. That's that's the idea of a freebie. I just want to get that out of the way in case you don't have a freebie or something. You should really highly consider working on that before you do any of these other things that I tell you about in this video. So here are the five things that you should be doing on YouTube if you're already delivering great content, but you also want to build your email list at the same time. Number one, utilize the links that are up in the header area of your YouTube channel. You have um, a handful of links you can put up there. The first one in that list gets an icon and a, a, like a descriptive word and the rest just get icons. So you wanna make sure you put your freebie up there. You want to link it to the opt-in page for your freebie that gets people on your email list. So you can kind of set it and forget it. And the way that you get into there is you have to go to the customized channel button and then you can change your links from there and you have a whole list. Number two, obviously if you're creating videos, you should mention your freebie, your lead magnet in your videos and then put a link in the description. In the YouTube description box, when you put in a link, it's clickable. You don't have to like do any HTML or anything. You could just put a link, maybe make sure that's like a pretty link or a bit.ly link or some type of shortened link there. Um, and just put it right maybe near the top or under your first paragraph so people can find it really easily. Number three, utilize the YouTube cards. YouTube cards allow you to link to something and it pops up above your head and you actually get to decide where in your video that it's gonna pop up, like the exact right moment that it's gonna pop up. You can link to other videos or other playlists or anything, but you can also link out to your website. In order to link out to your website, you have to verify your website with, um, with YouTube. So you have to make sure that you're all set up there and then you can link out to your freebie. So if you mention your freebie in your video, you can make sure that your card pops up at that moment. Brilliant, right? Number four, utilize the end screen. Now, if you don't know about the YouTube end screens, I love end screens. They make it so simple. Um, the last 20 seconds of your video, you can add um, videos, links to like other videos, uh, links to like your freebie, links to another channel. You can add a little subscribe link or something like that. If you just, if you watch this whole video, you can see what I do at the end of my videos, but you can link out to your freebie there as well. Same rules apply to to the cards, you have to um, have your, your site has to be verified in order to do that. Um, but it's a great way to get people, you know, at the end of your video to go ahead and click that link out to your freebie. It's a good little time to remind them about the freebie as well. Number five, max loop. What the heck is a max loop? It's something that I like to call the maximizer loop. And I actually went into detail on this um, in the Video Pursuit podcast on episode number 12, where I talked about what the max loop is and how to do it. It's a really simple but powerful tactic to use your YouTube channel and a playlist and a series of videos to get people onto your email list and then 
also maximize the number of views. So not only are you getting more views on your channel and on your videos, but you're getting people onto your email list as well. All in one, it's super simple, really powerful. If you want all of the details, and if you want all of the details about that, you can head over to the Video Pursuit Podcast. It's episode number 12. You can get there by going to vidpromom.com slash podcast, or you can just search up Video Pursuit Podcast in whatever podcast player you use. So that's it. I hope my five favorite tips for growing my email list on YouTube were helpful for you. If they were, give this video a big thumbs up. And I promise to tell you about where we can continue this YouTube Playbook for Bloggers series. So here's the deal. I created the Video for Bloggers group over on Facebook, and I would love to have you join me there. We're gonna be talking a lot about YouTube, but also IGTV, which is like this whole new thing. If you haven't heard about it, you should look it up. Um, and then we'll probably talk about Facebook video as well, because there's always things going on with Facebook video and we want to make sure we maximize everything that we're doing on video because it is so powerful. So I'll put a link down below um, to that Facebook group request to join and then we can stay in touch over there. So like I said, I'll put a link down below to that group and also to my YouTube for bloggers checklist and cheat sheet that you can join as well. Or you can probably just hit one of the little buttons here on my end screen. So thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye.